Hello, in this video, I would like to show you how to upgrade this uh, 9.4 inch uh, display uh, from CCFL to our UB series LED kit. This LED kit comes with one LED strips, one driver, and one six pin. Only have two wire pigtail connectors. Okay, let's set aside the LED kit for a second. Take a look at this uh, CNG controller. This is uh, made by Fanat. The Fanat part number is A02B0222-C110. It has a 9.4 inch uh, black and white display. Um, obviously, the back cover only remove it. Uh, you see the backlight lamp here. They're using a TDK one. <clears throat> so, uh, first we're going to disconnect this CCFL and then we're going to remove these four screws and then we can take out the screen and take a look at the screens, okay? Okay, this is the last screw. We take it out. Okay, we set it aside. We're going to... I, I think... Okay, so we can take it out, set it aside this front bezels, this is the screen, okay we're gonna flick over, so obviously you can see the lamp was mounted vertically, so what we can do is it can be mounted by the same locations, so it's easy, first thing we're gonna remove the, just click, you see, one, two, Three, three clicks plastic we're gonna straighten it up and then we can uh, probably uh, just take out a hook for you can just simply take out the lamps okay it looks like it so this shit we're gonna take out the shit okay let me see let me use the tree okay so up oh. all right here we go the lamp we're gonna take out the lamp okay Here's the lamp. So and then, what we can do is like we're gonna mount back the <coughs> our LED kits. I mean LED strips just like this. Okay. Let me see. Yep. That looks good. So we're gonna put it back the the sheets. So when you put the shit back, make sure the LED is straight like this. I want to show it to you, maybe close look. So when you put back that, this shit, make sure the LED is straight facing to uh, to the proxy glass, like this. And then you can put back the back cover, okay? See this? Yep, that looks good. So we have removed the lamp. So I think the best way to mount it would be <coughs> get a piece of additional a uh, aluminum foil or whatever the stick you have or you can just pull back like <coughs> like what I showed you before but I think the best would be like this make it a little bit thicker see that then you just slice in yep just like that perfect okay then you can bend this plastic Oh. Okay, so like I said, there's two ways to mount it. <clears throat> if you have extra aluminum, and then you can make it, you know, fix better. I want to show you, see, fix better. Or if you don't, you can just take the lamp out, put it back, just like I showed you before. And then we got to flip over and secure the wires here. Add a piece of tape to secure wire. Next video, I'm going to show you how to mount it. Okay, we have just finished mounting the LED. It's pretty straightforward. <coughs> I show you two ways to mount it. Um, you know, just remove the lamp out and uh, put our LED uh, strip in. Or the, the other method, if you have extra aluminum, then you can make it a little thicker and put it back. So, <coughs> this end connect to here, either connectors, all right? And then this end connect to here. So, here's the original inverter, but since it has a space, I'm going to mount like this. So then I'm going to solder this two wire to this 24 volt input. Uh, positive, negative, just solder here. I will show you a video, next video. And then uh, 
Then we can fire up and uh, take a look. Start of this red to positive 24 volt, black to the ground, direct to the input conductors. All right, so this is red, this is black, okay. Basically, you just connect this one, <coughs> this end, you can connect to either one, and you can connect this end to here. So just, I mean, yeah, we're gonna mount it somewhere like, like this, perfect. So I'm gonna peel off the double side tip. Of course, you need to cut in a little bit here. And then just simply peel it off. And just mount it just like this. Perfect, okay. Then we can secure the wires, both wires and fire up to test and see what the result is. So I secure the wires, you see, and then we're gonna, I have a connector here, so we can fire up a 24 volt uh, to see what happens. And let me shut my overhead light first. And then, like I said, this is a 9.4 inch display, black and white. Um, so just, fire up you see this it's pretty good graphics ready so this black and white and see how easy it is thank you for watching